hello guys and welcome to a new brand video into this tutorial i'm going to show you how to use community components on figma so now the first thing that you will need to do is to open your web browser and then you will need just to go to search bar so you can use any web browser either it was google chrome microsoft edge mozilla firefox or any web browser will do the work after that we need just to search for figma and then we will find the first link that is the www.figma.com you click on it and basically you will need just to log in or create an account and basically here i'm already logged in you can just create an account by clicking on get started for free or you can just go and log in if you had already your account so basically i'm just going to log in my account now and after that we will need to create a new design here so basically you can just go and create new design file you click on it and basically it will take you to your working space and now all that you need to do is to follow these simple steps so now all we need to do is to go to the main menu and again go back uh, back to files and we are just going to explore the community after that we will need just to search for some components that we can download or just add on our products so let's uh, just go for the free ones and go to any products that means uh, we can go for these components and let's try it out and basically you can just go here to the projects and we can find all these components and basically all you need to do is to share them or uh, to have a copy that means to duplicate them to have them or move them to your project that means you will need just to go to the project and then you can be able to use them as assets on the libraries or uh, of these components so as you can see those are all components you can just copy and paste them to your project let's just go back to our untitled and we can just paste it or uh, let's go back here we can just move it to any page you can uh, do whatever you want so let's just do like that and then we can have it on our page or you can find them on your assets if you are using libraries on your figma so basically those are all the components that you can use and you can just take them from uh, these templates and use them to your on your projects so basically this is how you can do it thank you for watching and see you next time